What is up guys, it's your boy What is Boy 1991 here and I'm back with the Kang's Dinner of Doom tier 2 Yes, I marked on X Marker Spot which is not a tier a Kang Dinner of Doom meal I'm just here because I was trying to get done because I reset just when it started and I only had 450 Not enough to the first one because I already unlocked those first two via challenges As always guys, you can unlock the characters via challenges after the event has come out but first in order to do them you need the challenges and you need these apple pies i guess pumpkin pies so i'm probably going to do a, a, this two videos one of these guys and then one of this i'm looking the two and if i'm lucky i might add the other three of the next event but first we have a gravy train beat 150 with a literal gravy train it's this five there, that is actually where the formation of the gravy train is, and it's where it's going to be, and it's going to block, block a lot of space out. Played Friday deals, it's the second deal that we've got for another chest. Discount Crusaders, they cost less, but they do much, much less DPS. Ouch. For the third one, the new deal that came off of this year, because they added it after a couple of doing all these events. So everyone's been doing this. The attack of the turkeys. Rabid turkeys attack your formation and must be defeated. So they're coming really quick from the front. That is fine. Now the free plays, I'll do a couple of free plays. Not I can do it at the end once I get to the rest of these because it shouldn't be too bad. Maybe I might do the free plays first before tier two, because the tier two I can do next year, maybe I'm not high enough to do all of them. Anyway. I'll do it in a minute, but first, as always. I'll show you what epic gear they've got for this time. It's for Mama Kane. That was the character you get for last year. So if you haven't unlocked it yet, you're gonna have to wait a little bit. But I never got it, so that's why it's not popping up. So yes, it's the Quantum Locked Vial of Life Giving Goo. It increases the per effect of Mama Kane's perk up ability by 150%. A single drop of this stuff could save every life on Earth. If only it weren't locked shut. Nuts. And that's what I'm gonna buy and give it to them because I love it. And also, I think I may have said it, but I haven't. I bought a Crusader for a charity. His name is Graham the Driver. It's part of Loading Ready One's Desert Bus promotion they were talking to Kona M Entertainment about. And it's all epic out because I paid a fair amount of money on it. Anyway, we'll be back with the next um, the extra challenge, as well as I really have that gear. Yay. And here we go. The gravy train has started. It's going to be really simple because being gravy train. But yes, as you can see, it takes one, two, three of a big formation. The one, two, one, two, three, I think it is. Because of the train itself, the literal gravy train. Uh, good old Thanksgiving. Oh, what about gravy trains? Nah, it's not gonna be difficult. Like last time, most challenges now are 150s. A breeze. Oh, I will pretty much see you at the end of this. So, we're definitely done now at level 162 and the key was to 150. Yes, we have done. So, I get the first chest, which will probably either go, I guess, go to Mother McCain with the rune lock and Jack the pumpkin. I can also leave it to the end and open up the chest for when I have um unlock the other two tier two characters. Intriguing. I'll probably leave with the other two. So we've done it. We'll move on to the next one now, which is the place played fly day deals. Get the two hundred with the discount crusaders, but they cost cheap, but they are not much DPS wise. For the second of the chests, it'll be alright, and uh, I'll get on to it. So yep, no, like the first one being the second event they released of the Cold Tournament, in fact, or Cold League, it's going to be rather simple, so 200 while being a little bit expensive, no, uh, they're cheaper, yes. DPS wise, they're yeah, a little bit less, but I feel like it'll be the same like normal, you do a continuous update while you're playing, it'll be done. But I've got a little bit of time because I need to build up the experience points for the um next to do the third mission of this. 
tier, tier one. So I'll probably be sitting on this for for about a half a day or two. I'll come back when we clean close to the end. So yeah, a couple of hours into it, I'm right. Definitely, as I said, it's definitely more difficult to level up. Well, level up's easy because it's cheap, but the DPS is the little issue as always. To get to 200, I believe, yes, it, it, it'd be taking a little while, not too long. It gives me enough time to get enough tokens to go do the next tier, third and final tier one challenge. I'll be happy for that. I can easily do that. It's not difficult at all. Yay, I'll see you when I get closer still. Maybe at 200? So yes, we're definitely at 206. It, yeah, it takes a little while. At the come point moment with the thing being in my way, I've got 1882. I'm definitely going to reset it straight off this. Do I have enough to start the next one? I have two and a half. So, no, I won't be do it yet. I'll be waiting for a little bit unless I do another time pass. I'll probably do another time pass and then we'll get ready to start the next challenge, but we did it. Anyway, before I do that, I thought I'd just quickly let's give you guys the idea of what the challenge is next. Attack of the Turkeys. And it's Raven Turkeys. Attack your formation and must be defeated and you must reach 250 while these are Turkeys are attacking you. Not difficult at all. Not difficult at all. So, I'll see you when I start it. So, yep, no, I've started that. And now I want to find out how soon these turkeys come through. Because I said they occasionally have a Russian turkey. There's a turkey there. And once I start attacking, it's not running though. When is the running turkey going to occur? They said it's a running turkey. I want running turkeys. Ah, I see no running turkeys. They're not running yet. It's still walking. Ah, oh, because there's the actual turkeys. Where's the rabbit turkeys? Rabbit turkeys. There we go. Found them. That makes sense. Okay, not too difficult. 250 with them in the background. Again, it's all about DPS, isn't it? DPS, DPS, DPS with the first tier. Also, I don't know if it's going to pop up, but I hadn't noticed the occasionally the turkeys. They throw food. See? There's a turkey throwing food on my face. Ugh. Wow, turkey! You're not throwing food. So it ran, and it started throwing turkeys on my face. And they slowed down after a while. That one's running. But the others will throw turkeys in my face. Ah, eh, not too bad. So yeah, no, <laughs> um, I've definitely done it. Sorry about that. Now, um, it's one of those usually updated to get the damage to push through to keep killing everything else. Because if you kill everything else fast enough, if you don't, you can push through faster than the kill of things. Also, normal rule. Every boss level, there is none of the turkeys or anything throwing you down. They get really stupid after a while. But, yep, no, that's cool. That's probably cool. I'll probably quickly throw in, as always, the usual things I do, which I did not last time. And it was doing the, um, free plays. But I probably won't do the free plays because the last time I missed one too many videos. But my mind i'll probably start to quickly hammer out these other ones now so after this reset i'll quickly give you an explanation of what they are and i'll try and smash out the tier two as well let's see how i go with nine days should be not too difficult in my mind let's see what happens also i guess i'll do it while i'm here i did also have done a bit of a flat sense of plan i've got certain k at least now I've managed to max out that fishing crusading, so now instead of going from 500, it's now 250. So now that makes it a lot more money, and now I'm trying to create a time with this one to push it through so I can get every time I push for longer and longer and longer. Every level gives you a certain percentage of the like 6 or the 8 or whatnot. And then after that, I'll probably push through to get to see all the times and whatnot. But we did it, it's fine. It does its job, but I want to quickly just see how much I've got now to reset. I'll get 165 for that reset for this run. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Anyway, we did it, guys. So, yeah, I think I've probably said before we did it. And uh, I'll let the do the usual thing. Anyway, I'll see you next video, guys, which will be the tier 2s.
So yeah guys, thank you for watching my videos guys. This is tier 1 we've done now, we're on to doing tier 2. As always guys, like, comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos than Kotli and occasionally other. There you saw with the Battleborn opening and whatnot. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.